Okay, so in this video I'm going to show you how to make a pirate ship with an egg carton. Okay, so I've got um, my egg carton and I've cut off the lid, as you can see, so it's just the bottom bit. I've also got some scissors, um, I've got some sellotape, or any tape is fine, as long as you, or glue is fine. I've just got some paper here, in different colours, and you can either use a straw or you can have a rolled up piece of paper as well. It's up to you. And I've got some different coloured paper cut out into triangles to make the flags for the ship. So this can be from the story... Oh, and I've got some paint as well. So this can be from the story um, Swallows and the Amazons. Okay, let's get started. So I'm just going to start with painting the bottom blue. Because um, I think that's a good colour. So I'm just using acrylic paint and I'm just going to paint all of the bottom blue. Okay, so I've just finished painting the bottom blue. You don't have to do the very bottom if you don't want to. You don't even have to paint it. If you don't have paint, don't worry about it. You can still make the ship without painting it. Um, you can colour it in if you like with pencils or pens. And now the next step is just to paint the inside of the boat um, or colour it in or you can decorate it with paper or pencils or pens. You don't have to use paint. Okay, so I'm going to do the inside green. Okay, so I've just finished painting the inside of the box green. Uh, remember you can colour it in if you don't have any paints. Um, so once that's dry, whilst that's drying, we can get ready for the um, decorations for the boat. So if you've got some paper, so this is A5 paper, I've just cut a piece of A4 in half, uh, you know, coloured and all that. Um, basically, you can just roll it up from the side, like so. Um, so it's nice and strong. And if you've got some tape, um, you can just tape it in place. Just to hold it in place. You can put it all the way along if you like. So you want two of these. They don't have to be that long. You can cut them a bit shorter if you like. So I've got one this size and I've cut a little one as well. These are going to be the masts on your boots to hold your flags up. So here and here. Okay, so we'll just leave those to one side. And I've got some... Uh, I've just cut some triangle shapes out. One for the little flag and one for the big flag. Um, for the masts. And I'm just going to use some colouring pens to decorate. So I might put some blue dots on or I don't know, let's do like a bird why not so you can choose whatever pattern you like and on this one I might do some circles so what you want to do is get your uh, big flag and your your longer um, pole that you've made out of paper and you're just going to sellotape you're not going to put it all the way at the bottom that's not right put it like near the top and just sellotape it on um, or glue it on however you want to do so I'm just using a little bit of sellotape and I'm just going to put it along this edge here like so, and I'm just attaching it here. Okay, so that's that flag done. And same for the little one. Two flags ready to go on top of your boat. 
Okay, so hopefully your boat is dry now. And what you're going to do is attach the flags on here and here. Okay, so I'm just going to use some um, summer tape again. Or you can use duct tape or double sided tape or glue. So I'm just going to set a tape around here to the egg carton, the mass to the egg carton. Lovely, and that is holding that flag there. And I'm just going to do that with the little one as well. So you get enough sellotape to go round. And attach that as well. You can do them at angles if you like. So you can see the flags. It's up to you how you put them on. Just attach that round. Okay, so there we have it. There is your ship with your flags. Nice and easy out of an egg carton and paper. Um, if you want to, you can try and make boats, some other boats, and see if they float on some water if you like. They probably won't float for long because egg cartons will get very soggy but see if you can have a boat race if you've got more than one of you see which one wins okay thank you for watching